Alrighty, so today we are going to play Labyrinth. This is a really fun game. Even fun for younger kids to play. Uh, this is the board game. Take out all the tiles and get it all lined up on the board. Hey, Perry, you want to help? Okay, so you'll notice with this game that after you get all the way set up, you will have one tile left over. This is kind of the tile that keeps track of whose turn it is first, and so you'll leave that aside. It does not need to go on the board. So then you put up all your people on their respective colors, red and green, yellow and blue, Today it's just me and Perry. Perry, what color do you want to be? I'll just be blue. You'll be blue? I'll be yellow. Okay. And then, in the rules, you will take all of your item cards, and it says to divide them evenly between the players. Um, in reality, that would take a really long time, especially with two people. So today we're just going to divide out four cards, and then... After you divide it out, one, four, divide it, and then you only look at one card at a time. You can't look at all of your cards. So this is mine, and this is the item that you are going to try to get to first. So this is your starting place. And then, on your turn, you will be able to move anywhere on the board where the trail follows. So up and down. I don't have much options for me to go, just straight across. It doesn't matter how many tiles you move. You can move as many as you want, just have to stay on the path. So, for this one, for me, I... I'm going to need to get to a place where it will be easy for me to obtain that tile. Um, you can use this tile to further enhance your ability to get there, kind of move the board around. And you actually have to use you it. You have to use it on your, on your turn. Um, and these little yellow arrows tell you where you can go. Um, the places where there aren't arrows, there are like permanent tiles and you can't move it. So on your turn, you can move it. And then um, whatever tile comes out after you move the board is then Perry's tile. So then on his turn, he will then be able to use that tile to try and attain his item. Um, now, part one of the rules is that once you move... Once you put one tile in one direction and this one comes out here, you cannot put it right back where it came out of. That is against the rules. You can so, go on the other side. You can go on the other side. Um, another random rule, um, say your guy was right there on that tile and your opponent or yourself pushed you off the board and your little guy goes off the board then you start, you move your guy right back over there as if he had just kind of jumped sides. And that's pretty much it. So I am going to go right there. And I'm going to move. Now Sperry's turn. I'm guessing that's not your item, the dragon there. <laughs> All right, mine is pretty far away, and this does not help me. Let's do this one. So that one's yours. I'm As a way to remember uh, where your, the tile came out of, you can leave the tile there until you are ready to play so that you remember that it stays there and you can't put it there. But you don't have to. It's just a way to remember. Let me stay there. Hey, you moved my guy. Sometimes a turn can go really quick. 
sometimes it can be a little while. I think with four people, it goes a little bit faster. You get moved around quite a bit. Yeah. Okay. This is a pretty good one for me. Okay, Actually, now this either. is a hard one because I would want to put that there and move my guy up so that I can get the moth, but I can't move it. So I will then move him to me. And then, woohoo, I got the moth. And then once you get your item, then you flip it over and show your opponent. And whoever gets to, whoever, a, reaches all of their items first wins. So this is our next little guy. And we'll see if we can get him. All right, got another corner piece. Um, I think this works actually, yeah, there it is. My owl. Nice. Oh, you guys. This piece is the perfect piece. So, I got Mr. Ghost Dude. So I'm gonna go up here and be able to connect the trail. And then I go, do 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 Ghost Dude, hooray! So that's two turns in a row. Let's catch up. This is our next one. What was I going for again? <laughs> <laughs> you can play this game with two to four players. Here we go. And on the box it says... Straight to my gym. Ages 70 to 99. So if you're older than 99, I'm sorry, you can't play. <laughs> what happened here? I pushed off two. Did I? No, that's where the tile came out of. No, I think I did that. I think I cheated. Did I push too much? And I wasn't paying attention? I don't know. Yeah, I pushed just one too many. There we go. Still was the same result. But hey, guys. You can only push one out. I don't think we ever talked about that, but. That messed up our plan. Oh, by the way. Yeah, that was messed oh, up. Oh, you reached your goal, huh? Uh-huh. Well, the only way we can go to get semi-close is right there. I don't want to go right there because then I'll just be booted right off the board. Oh, I need to move the tile, though. And I'm going to go right there. <sighs> Straight tile. We're almost there. Shh. Let's just do that, then. We want a straight we'll piece. We'll break this, We though. want a straight piece. Yay! Cheers. All right. Did you get the third one? Do, 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 do. Treasure! Okay, well, I will get mine as well. Princess. Okay, who's gonna win? Oh, guess what? Woohoo! We get to win! We can get there. Do -do 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 oh. Without moving anything? Yeah. And if you can do that, you just kind of move the tile wherever you want. You're lucky. Or I guess we tie, right? Because I mean, my next move will be the same. <sighs> And you went first. That's kind of why <laughs> the rules say to divide all of the cards, because then it kind of spaces you out a little bit. You still have the same effect. There are a whole lot of cards, and we would be here for ages. I think every time we play but, with four people, we only give everyone five cards, and that's how we play. Yeah. Anyways, fun little quick game, easy setup. Uh, super simple to explain and super simple to set up and... Fun for even little kids. <laughs>